I'd like to now uh, recognize both Tammy Freeman, who's the district representative for Leader Dogs for the Blind, to say a few words. And then after Tammy speaks, I'm going to ask Dallas Weens if he would say a few words. Tammy? Where's okay, Dallas is going to speak first. All right. Okay, there we go. I don't really know how to express my gratitude to the South Lake Lions and to everything that they've done for me. But I can tell you that um, I would love to be involved in anything they do from this point on. Um, especially, but not limited to the Ride for the Blind. I want to be able to be a part of that just to see the progression of other people who are in my position who need a better mode of transportation than a cane. I also want to just express my love and my gratitude to them. They have offered me an opportunity for transportation that is unparalleled by any other means and a way of independence that I never thought I would be able to accomplish. And the process from transferring from a cane to Charlie has been smooth due to the assistance they gave me to not only qualify, but the application process for Leader Dog. And Leader Dog in and of itself is not only an amazing school and an amazing program, but the instructors there are wonderful people. They truly care and they have left almost every walk of life simply to train dogs as guides for the visually impaired. I have personally had the honor of having a prior attorney as well as a prior tattoo artist as my instructors. So every walk of life. It is phenomenal to see people give up whatever it is they had to do what they can for other people. And it's exactly what I am doing. My fiance and I, as well as other burn survivors, have begun an organization called Pen with a Purpose, which is our way of giving back to the community and to those in need and those who need the hope and the peace and serenity that we found. And an avenue that I have reached, that peace and serenity, has been from the South Lake Lions. So God bless you all. <laughs>